CoreLogix is a company in the observability space, though our vision is a lot broader. We're talking about transforming how businesses make decisions. Observability data being the highest volume, variety, and most real-time data that a business generates has to become the forefront of how businesses make decisions, other than you know, using BI information that's a lot more specific, a lot more reactive, and a lot less real-time. Now tell me, how are you unique to others that may be in this space? Besides our vision, which is obviously driving a lot more towards the business outcome than just fixing issues, um, CoreLogix analyzes all the data in stream, then query the data from the customer's own remote storage. That capability to analyze in stream and query from remote gives a lot more scale, a lot more performance, and it's also a lot more cost efficient. And finally, Ariel, as you look to the next 12 months, what are your priorities? What are you focused on? Our priorities now in CoreLogix, first of all, completing our full suite of products and building out the platform that CoreLogix is, meaning serving all our market segments and all the products that we do today, logs, metrics, tracing, APM, realism monitoring, and then tying it up together to what we call data sets. The ability to look at data, not as different pillars, but as one data set that represents a business unit and be able to ask questions that are business driven. So if today monitoring tools focus on questions like what machines are down, where do I have a high error rate? Where is latency high? The questions that we're going to answer are, where's my business losing revenue? Where should I invest my R&D time? Where are my customers most frustrated and what should I fix in order to, to, to make them happy? And those are complete different sets of questions that we're focusing on for the next 12 months. All right, well, Ariel, it's been wonderful to talk with you. Thank you very much for having me. Thanks for joining me on Floor Talk.